Oh, God. Oh. He looks you guys up and down, uh, and he says, uh, All right, uh, welcome to Nancy's. I take it you're not from the slum, so there is a small, uh, a small cover fee for uh, people like yourselves. Five silvers a head. Uh, Les says, uh, certainly, and he just hands in, uh, over the silver, paying for everyone. All right, so Carl, take, uh, 35? one... 35 silvers off your sheet, sure. Okay. Thir three gold. Wait, you said uh, thir 35 silver? No, uh, just because I paid for everyone. Th not just that. Oh, he pays friend. for everyone. Yeah. He says, also, if hey. I may suggest, really quickly, Drew, do you want to give Gorgon to someone, or is that already... Uh, yeah, do you want to just tag along with you? I'll, uh, throw you control. Uh, he's controlled by all players. Yeah, he's controlled by everyone. I just, if you want someone in particular, stick. Uh, anyone who's not Carl. Damn it. Okay. Why don't you take him home? Um, he says, uh, let me look you over quickly. He says, no mass cleavers. Uh, he points at Yang. He says, your sword needs to wait in the barrel. And he points at Gamry's sword and says, yours as well. Does anyone else have any visible weapons that aren't light weapons? No. Nothing visible, no. Because um, you have a sword cane, eh? Sharp bow and two, yeah, and a pistol. two chakrams. Uh, he makes you put the bow uh, in the crate behind him. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with that. <sighs> yeah, I'll do that. So Gamry agrees reluctantly. It's custom. Uh, Leslie, he, he says, from. hold up, and he grabs your cane. Yes. He says, uh, and he pulls it out of its teeth, and she says, this too. <laughs> of course, I'm yeah, yeah. sorry. I thought you were only interested in heavier duty weapons. <laughs> he says, uh, you wouldn't be the first one to try and sneak something, the, sneak something like that in Nancy's. Well, come on in. Drinks are cheap. Uh, company's decent. <laughs> Why? What does wow. he mean by that? I'm with decent company. I see. <laughs> He's not the proprietor. As he you walk in, uh, it's a pretty hopping place. Uh, you see all sorts of things. So you can see a bunch of uh, bar wenches talking to people. Uh, an old battled pirate. There is a bard playing the lute in the corner. Uh, there are wenches serving drinks. And yes. Oh, At least you're calling them by their proper title. I appreciate uh, that. Not enough winches. So we the guy who was it. described to me, do I? Do uh, I there's not? children in the bar, which are also playing, uh, playing dice and drinking beer. There's children here. <laughs> oh, look at these fucking badasses! <laughs> look at these Yo. fucking. Kids. It's never Anna too early kills to kills herself, so I can play as one of these kids. <laughs> Don't put me through that kind of emotional That IP. would kind of be sweet. <laughs> Don't put me through <laughs> I want to see Luke play that out. Imagine and those then you kids come back with a British this. accent. Oh, it might. Better, those jokes. Better X that <laughs> off. Look at these fucking kids, dude. <laughs> Can you uh, keep this hand out public after we stop playing? <laughs> 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 No, uh, uh, no. and uh, over the uh, presumable like cacophony, Anna looks over to Yang and just sort of like scans the room. Do, do we have a description of what Hobbs looks like? Uh, he's a hobgoblin, <laughs> and that's about all you know. Well, that uh, should stand out. Right. Well, should go to the. If anybody the will know about the man we're looking for, it's bound to be. One of the bones. Uh, Sveltna, you think it is the... Uh, after looking through the crowd of smoke, uh, you think you can spot him over here. Les coughs and tries to move away from the kid. Uh, you notice that, uh, Leslie, the people on this table, uh, they're snorting some sort of powder off the table. Even the kid? Uh, at this table? Uh, no, the kid's just smoking. Can I do a craft alchemy to try to identify it? Yes, you may. 17? Uh, just let me check the DC on that. Good old opium. And we do approach Yang and let him know that I spotted homie. These are some good tokens. I spotted him. 
Okay. Uh, sorry, that didn't take me. To... Yeah. Hey, there's the guy from the pirate bar. Look, near the hobgoblin, slightly to the left. Oh yeah, that dude. I reused the uh, picture for that. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Duh. My immersion. <laughs> what was his name? Let's go talk to him. Hey, we've heard about you. Bill uh, the bartender. I'm I from a different campaign, lad. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like was first level in your last campaign. Do you know how much time has passed? Go <laughs> fuck with me. <laughs> Remember me when I was a dwarf? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to do a. Uh... Perception check to see if uh, see how how uh, how much of people's attention have we get gained. Uh, okay, so I'm just gonna ask her. Uh, finish, Bishop. Bishop, the, su the substance they are uh, snorting is called flayleaf. Do I know anything about it? Uh, let's see here. Uh, Flay Leaf is an inhaled or ingested drug. Uh, Gesundheit, type baby. Uh, it's supposed to give you a, uh, like, if you were to use it in combat, it kind of hardens your mind, uh, but it does some overall damage, like, it does overall damage to your uh, psyche afterwards. Huh. So it has a very calming, like, mellow effect for the duration that the drug is active, but afterwards, uh, people who have too much exposure to flay leaf often have very painful and vivid hallucinations when they're no longer high. Uh, Thrindle, it's kind of hard to tell. You're coughing a little bit because of the uh, exposure to some of the drugs in the air. Uh, not to mention the tobacco smoke alone in this high of concentration is almost oppressive. Uh, so Anna looks to Anna puts a hand on Yang's shoulder because uh, I imagine it's loud in here, yeah. and she says, uh, uh, "I'm gonna wait at the bar with Gorgon. We'll keep an eye on you if anything should happen." Good plan. Uh, Anna, yourself, Gamry, and Svelta notice that this prostitute has her hand on this. Uh, looks like a uh, a weathered old coal course there. Uh, has her hand on their knee and she's whispering into his ear. Neat. Uh, I, 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 it's a horror. Hide her eyes. <laughs> Don't look at this. <laughs> Les wants to introduce himself to the table. Say hello, gentlemen. What's the game? Uh, just fucking jerk them off. Are they not gambling? Uh, <laughs> No, they're uh, most of them are sitting back in their chairs, kind of staring off into the <coughs> face, occasionally taking a drag from a cigarette. I misread the situation. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm looking around for someone who's gambling. All right, uh, you can find one. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to throw down a, an initiative order, just so we don't all over go over each other. Oh, um, you said ovary. Could uh, are you guys gonna split into groups? So Leslie, <laughs> oh, Jesus. Uh, Le Leslie and Gamry, are you guys gonna pair off or? Yeah, that's my bro. Uh, okay, so yeah. You guys are fags. Chill. <laughs> Just saying. Why do I have multiple Annas? Oh, it's because it's empty. But I think if we roll it, oh, when you roll initiative, does it add your token? Oh, maybe it does. Yeah, yeah, maybe it does. Oh. Yeah, uh, we can't see the turn order, by the way, Drew. You'll have to redo it. Yeah, yeah dude. If you could do it, it, you guys it. we have character sheets. I do oh too, gosh, but I don't know where the, the initiative. Where's the initiative button on? <laughs> on the character sheet? It is under oh, there core. It is. Yeah, it's like the fifth one down. It is kind of in a weird place. Mine didn't uh, work. There's going to be two Yanks now because you. Didn't need to add me. Yeah, you have to select. Uh, you have to select oh, your yeah. token, then roll it. Oh, it was yeah. selected actually. No. Well, then it, it would have added a new Thorindo. Oh, okay. It's because oh, Drew is adding our tokens. Good job. Okay, am I missing anyone? Gamry, you're not on there. Oh, Gamry. Thanks. Technically, it was seventeen, but a. A. <clears throat> All right, so everyone's got it entered. Sending. Sir Gamry, we're going to start with you. What are you up to? All right, Gamry whispers to Les. 
I'm feeling uneasy in this room. I'm just going to sit in the corner. My uh, my cleaving arm is itching. I don't blame you. <laughs> hey, but if I get into trouble gambling, it might be good to have you with me. You have a presence. I'll be nearby. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> these two are gonna get. Into uh, the bar wing, uh, the bar wench comes up to you, and she says, uh, "She looks like a little bit of an older wench." <coughs> says, "What are you having?" The ginger ale. <laughs> and she says, <laughs> I, don't, "I don't know." What she, she, your order, uh, your order confuses her, and she says, "I'll get you the closest thing we got." Um, <laughs> she takes a pop top bottle uh, out from underneath the counter, pops it open, pours it into a glass, and pa- passes it over to you. <laughs> uh, thank you. I'll take milk. Everybody looks at it. <laughs> uh, so, Sir Gamry, you notice right away that it kind of piques your senses. It's a ginger beer. Perfect. perfect. Ginger beer isn't actually alcoholic. This one is. Oh. Everything here. Thrindle. Is alcoholic. So, Thrindle will. Uh... Casually walk up and sit down beside the hobgoblin. It's a hobgoblin, correct? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I will, in his own language, I will say... Uh, oh, you speak hob? Uh, you speak hob? Yeah, I do. That's he awesome. taught it to me. Oh, That's cool. Wild. That's my explanation, anyways. I sure did. I, I will uh, come over and sit down beside him and say... Uh, what, is there a proper way to address? The, do they have some sort of colloquial so like green skin there? Uh, uh, no, you can basically. Um, they're pretty blunt and to the point, so they're like, uh, like you would you would normally in hobgoblin society um, address them by what you're after. So, like, if you were saying like, uh, "Hello, merchant," if you wanted to buy something, or it'd be like. Uh, uh, gotcha. hello, sex partner, and they'd be like, "I can't," you know, like you start with business, not with, with uh, Roger that. Yeah, greetings, greetings, fence. Uh, he smiles and says, "Uh, you talk like a Bryn elf. I'm surprised. His accent is very different than Gorgon's. It's uh, was, cruder and kind of was, uh, less traditional." I was taught by a Bryn. <clears throat> he says, ah, they're an all right lot. They seem to be missing quite a bit since they left uh, uh, left the clan structure. He says, I'm guessing someone pointed you my way. Indeed. I was hoping that you could help us relieve some wares. He says, depends on what type of wares you want relieved. Some muskets. He smiles and says, I'm guessing by the tone of your voice that these ones are uh, probably hot. Exactly. They've been previously owned by the Empire. He says, ah, military grade. Mm. Uh, Let's take a look at them. I'm going to request that uh, my room get prepared. Throwing the nods. He says, um, don't follow me right away. Give me uh, 30 seconds here. I'll see if I can use uh, the kitchen. Uh, he says, the last switch room? Uh, he says, maybe Nancy will let me use her kitchen. And oh, he see. points to the uh, He nods his head to the back here. He says, uh, hey, is El- Elvin hearing very acute? Not as acute as you may have heard. He says, you'll hear this. And he disappears into the back room. Anna. I give uh, Thorindel a thumbs up. I'm impressed. He's so good at everything. I wish I was an elf, too. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, my God. Well, (laughs) uh, I'm mostly... I'm I'm not really going to do anything. I'm mostly just keeping an eye on the situation. So Anna's just going to stay at the bar. Okay, Leslie. She'll take it in the room. Uh, Leslie wanders in the direction of the people he thought was gambling. 
Uh, the two guys back here are gambling. They're